welcome back to my channel so this is going to be the content for this month bulan March so content bertema pada bulan ini adalah bertemakan tentang membina kekuatan or building strength so there are many kinds of strength right we can talk about physical strength mental strength or even spiritual strength so i think you can guess about the book that i'm going to talk about if you have read a book published by iman publication which is the spiritual strength in our scars by ustaza liana musfira so i believe that everyone has ever encountered a difficult situation and somehow that difficult moment makes us or change us to be who we are right now so there is always some other reason of why we are being like who we are right now or why we are doing what we are doing right now so everyone has a story to tell and that is all because of the things that have been done to us in the past actually this book is specially written for us women or sisters but that doesn't mean that all men or guys can't read this book because for me there is a general information or output that men can also apply to overcome the personal struggles or the struggles that encountered by women and it could help guys to understand women better so this book doesn't really tell us step by step on how to overcome our personal struggles and how to build resilience but it is more to um, needing us to put some effort to reflect on every story that has been shared by Ustaz Aliana Musfira based on real story of other sisters out there so it really helps us to see this world in a wider perspective so that we could develop that kind of empathy towards other sisters and also the most important point is to understand ourselves better as a woman based on my personal opinion maybe many people out there think that women are very complicated and overthinking nature and also they tend to have a very difficult personality to be understood such as having some kind of mood swings or whatsoever you name it but i think that is because women tend to face more difficult or complex difficulties such as when they are having to have some kind of physical changes emotional changes due to the pregnancy and also during their giving birth process and it consumes a lot of energy and it is very draining them physically emotionally and mentally especially when they don't receive enough support from their husbands or even from their family okay but boys don't get me wrong i'm not saying that boys don't receive or having any kind of difficulties but because this book is now talking about women so i am going to speak on behalf of women but i am not saying that guys or men never encounter any difficulties such as how women encounter okay so one of the conclusion that i can gain from this book is that to build resilience it requires a lot of effort physically mentally and also emotionally but it doesn't mean that we should just sit there and not doing anything and wait for things to change eventually without putting any effort of changing the condition we are in because it mentioned that in surah ar-rad surah 
Luka 13 ayat 11 it mentioned that verily Allah will not change the condition of a people as long as they do not change their step themselves so we still need to put effort if you want to change the way we are in right now so but it also requires patience and we have to accept the pain and slowly try to heal from the pain we are enduring with the support from our social network so for me this book reminds us women especially that we are not alone fighting our battles alone because somehow there is someone out there a sister out there that also having through the difficulties similar to ours but we just never tell anyone about it but this book has spoken on behalf of us about the personal struggles that most of women have to face but never tell anyone about it such as going through divorce or um, still finding their loved ones and also having some kind of broken relationship with their partner or even their parents and more about it I guess that's all from me today and if you love this video give a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel if you want to watch more book review contents on YouTube and also turn on the notification bell to get notification when I post a new video and before I forget you can search Biblio Mom because she has reviewed this book too on her YouTube channel and you can see a more comprehend or an overview of the topic list and also the dua list from this book on her YouTube channel and last but not least you can search on my Instagram account to read with Diana because I have posted a more personal opinion about this book and that's all have a nice day